Hey guys, thanks for joining me here on Scanner Danner Premium. My purpose for this quick intro is to show you guys some navigation on the site, show you where to start, and a few other aspects. So let's just get to it. There's the home page of Scanner Danner Premium. This is what it looks like after I log in. You can see my playlist over here to the left. Where we want to start with this is get familiar with this Scanner Danner drop down menu right here. First thing is when you're using this channel, make sure you are not using this box. Hopefully this will disappear soon, that this box can go away. Do not use that box. This is a Google search box and it's behind a paywall. This is the, the paid section of the site. So that box will not help us because Google does not have direct access to the information here. So we've provided a premium search box. This is the one you want to use. You would click on that and then type in your keywords and it works perfectly. So again, premium search on the drop down menu, not this one. That's number one. Second one, membership subscription uh, information is here. This will give you the dates of your subscription when it expires. Next one in the list, the Scanner Danner Premium email. Um, I want you guys to fill that out. Uh, click on that guy and fill out your, your information. Um, what this will do for you guys is kind of like YouTube when you hit the bell icon. Um, when I upload a new video, you'll get an email announcement where a new video was released. It will end up in your inbox. And then one more really important one that's on this list is the new video list for premium. So we're still working on this, but what this list has is all of the new videos since October of 2017, which was the transfer date for me pulling away from YouTube and moving all of my content over here. So all of the videos that I've released since October of 2017, you'll find in this list. Let's go there real quick. And you see my latest ones here. Uh, these were in July, uh, leak detection pump stuff, and then parasitic drain, RX-330, great case study, this RX-330. But this will give you a list of, it's about 50 or 60 videos right now on this new video list. Um, eventually we'll have all of the videos in here on a dated format. Right now we do not. All right, from there, main page of my channel. Where do you start? You're here. Where do you start? Well, it depends on your background, but my suggestion for newbies being on this channel would be to start in chapter one. Chapter one, follow along in my book. You can follow the lectures there in chapter one, which is where I start my classes here at the college at Rosedale Technical College. I would teach my new guys starting in chapter one. There's two other places I've taught the first week classes. This one down here. Basic electrical concepts right here, this guy. I've had uh, a subscriber recently just leave the channel and say, you know what, this is too advanced for me, I'm not ready. And maybe he didn't realize I have a whole bunch of basic electrical concepts in here and classes that I've taught to really kind of get you up to speed and ready to go to handle the chapter one material. So basic electrical concepts would be another one I would suggest. And then a final one would be the scope and scan tool classes. And I realize that I'm using primarily snap on stuff. Um, but what you need to remember about when I'm teaching things, sure, there's buttonology with, let's say we pick the Varus because the Varus is in here. Let's go in there real quick. Um, we have Varus, snap on Varus, Vantage Pro and Solus Pro. And I realized the Solus Pro and Vantage Pro, uh, they are not really making those anymore. So maybe you're thinking, well, that's not gonna help me. And maybe you don't have a Varus, but you need to understand that I'm teaching universal concepts in here. When we're talking about, for example, a scope and we're talking about trigger and slope and delay and sample and buffer and all of that stuff applies to any scope that you would use. So I'm suggesting that you would go in, in a week one environment and watch one of these, probably the Varus one it would be my suggestion because it has both the Vantage and Solus kind of morphed together in one unit that's in the Varus. Um, and I do some scan tool stuff in there that is not just unique to snap on again, universal concepts. So I had a guy recently tell me, Danner, I never watched the Varus series because I don't own one. 
and I didn't feel like it would be value of any value to me. And he was surprised about what he learned in there. This is like a 17 part, 11 hour training course on the Varus. A lot of it you might be able to skip through on the buttonology, but good stuff in there. Highly recommended first week, week one stuff. Okay. Back to my homepage, universal testing methods. That would be my first suggestion on where to start. All right, let's talk about this chapter real quick. Here's the breakdown of it. And there's also, uh, these would be the, the lectures that are in here. Anything that has a page number associated with it would be a lecture that's in my book, a lecture with the class. And then I have case studies down here. These would be case studies that are unique to chapter one. This is case studies for chapter one you will only find here on Scanner Danner Premium. These are not on YouTube, okay? However, we need to use my material effectively you need to understand that all of this stuff for universal testing methods, my chapter one material, I have, let's go to YouTube real quick. I have playlists set up on YouTube. These are free videos, but we can use these to enhance the class. Go to chapter one right here. This is my playlist on YouTube. There's right now to date, it's, there's 42 videos. So there are 42 case studies that are associated with chapter one in my textbook and in my classes. So that's on YouTube. Some of these are embedded. Let me show you. Let's say we do like uh, fuel trim at different loads, O2 at wide open throttle, pages four to eight expanded content. I want to show you guys what I've done in here. There's the thumbnail for the video. In the listing of this, there's our topics that are covered in this particular lecture. But then I have related videos. So these related videos may or may not take you back to YouTube. So I have some here of this dirty mass airflow sensor case study right here. That is a YouTube video. This how to test for a restricted exhaust catalytic converter. That's a YouTube video. Um, this one is a premium video. So this one right here. So just keep that in mind as you're going through this. Some of these links will take you right to the correct YouTube video. Some will take you to other areas in the premium area in the premium channel. But I want to emphasize again that not all, not all of these 42 videos that are on chap my chapter one playlist on YouTube made it into a related video lecture. So there's a, a whole ton of videos here you can watch as well when you're following my chapter one material. Okay. Um, that should be good. Navigation on your phone to get back to the home page on your phone. You might have some issues with this tab, but if you follow this kind of breadcrumb trail up top and just click on Scanner Danner Premium there, I know that that's on your phone. I've seen it on mine. That'll bring you right back to your home page. So just two more items. I want to talk about the feedback page and then I want to show you how to cancel should you want to leave. The feedback under the buy the book tab, there is a leave or read feedback section. I would really, really value my premium guys uh, leaving some feedback there for me, please. I, I, I want to get some current feedback in there. I have a lot of feedback in a lot of videos, but not where I want it, which is in this leave and read feedback page. If you guys could do that, I'd be really appreciative of that. As far as canceling your subscription, Go to the Scanner Danner Premium tab, go to Membership Subscription Information. You'll see that on here we have a um, started date and expires date, but no cancellation button. To cancel your subscription, what you need to do is you need to go to your PayPal account. I have mine pulled up. And you'll go to the Tools tab. Okay, the tools, this is all the tools under the tool drop down menu. And then you come over here to recurring payments. This is where you'll find Scanner Danner Premium, and that is where you cancel your access to, or that's where you cancel your subscription to my website. And you'll, you'll be able to have the remaining of the month, the remainder of the month, even when you cancel. For those of you that are here on a 14 day free trial, and you're trying to make sure you're not billed, that's what you would want to do. Sign up, you're here, it'll give you the dates. Just go to PayPal and cancel that subscription and you won't be charged. 
Most people, when you're here, you pretty much stay, at least for a while. Enough to go through the material that's here. Currently, as it sits, there's about 380 videos, combined lectures and case studies on this channel. Probably 200, 220 or so are lectures, and then um, the, the remaining 150, 140 would be exclusive case studies only available right here. So thank you again for joining me. I really appreciate you giving me a chance. I think you'll stick around. I look forward to hearing your comments under the video. So watch the videos, there's comment boxes. I read every single one of them and I try to answer them all. Thank you so much for being here. I'll see you guys later.